This is the story of Mamie Phipps Clark. She lived from 1917 to 1983. She was a social psychologist and a counselor. Despite growing up during the Great Depression and living in the segregated South, Mamie had a happy childhood comforted by family and school. She graduated at 16 and earned a scholarship to Howard University. Although she began with a major in math and a minor in physics, she eventually switched to psychology, the same major as Kenneth Clark, her future husband and research partner. Mamie never dreamed that segregation could be challenged, but in the summer of 1938, she worked for civil rights activist and NAACP lawyer Charles Houston. She saw famous lawyers gear up and tackle the monster that was segregation, and she realized that with the combined efforts of determined people, they could make real change. The work Mamie did in college was the beginning of breakthrough research that became known as the Doll Tests. The study showed an overwhelming preference for white dolls in black children ages three to seven. The children, half of whom attended segregated schools, were presented four dolls, two brown with black hair and two white with yellow hair, and were given instructions like, give me the doll that is nice, give me the doll that looks bad, and give me the doll that looks like you. Mamie and Kenneth concluded that the students from segregated schools had developed a sense of inferiority and self-hatred and that integration was helpful to both black and white children in achieving a healthy racial self-identification and improving race relations. This became key evidence in a landmark Supreme Court case, Brown v. Board of Education, which in 1954 ruled racial segregation unconstitutional in American public schools. Mamie's research altered the course of history for every child in America. She followed her passion, and it led her to make a difference in the world.